Lesson number one. Don't ever have kids. Hey, man, look. If I had kids, I don't think no parenting issues would arise over who had both privileges and who don't. Shit, motherfuckers would be lucky to sit in a bathtub. Shit, things that desperate, huh? Nah, but, you know, shit, I was making a point. Pathologizing self-deprecation. I know it well. Yeah, man, but shit, where the boat at? Little shit's been hijacked. They're somewhere on the Western Highway. Man, ain't you worried? About my boat? Yeah, I am. But you can always buy another boat. Yeah, tell my accountant that. Man, you can always get credit for one. But have you come repo it? No, thank you. <laughs> All right, homie. I ain't your homie. I'm someone you want to impress. Really? Man, I thought you was retired. Why the fuck do I want to impress some slipper-wearing motherfucker? Because I can still teach you a thing or two. Maybe help you open the door to all the joys that boat-related parenting issues entail. So I'm gonna help you get this boat back, right? That you are, my friend. I'm gonna get you close, and you're gonna go board that thing. All right, man, shit. Fuck it, let's do this. All right, I got a piece in the glove box. They give you shit, I'll take them out. All that's cool, man. You shoot them with one hand and drive them with the other. But my motherfucking concern is I might miss the jump and fall in fucking trap. You said you wanted to learn from the best. Let's call this lesson number one. All tight, man. Huh? Oh, fuck this. Yay! Now we're gonna have to paint the hole. Ah, crap. Ah, too close. Fuck, kid. Throw him overboard. Shit, no ass on him. Hey, there ain't room up there for the both of you. Fucking animal. You got four lanes to throw guys at. If you hurt my boy, or my boat, you're screwing with the wrong retiree! Hey, hey, get caught with me! Hey, shoot this motherfucker! Stop it! You on the wrong boat, boy! Nah, you on the wrong boat! Jesus! Okay, now go find Jimmy. Oh, crap. Dad? Wait, you're the guy from the dealership. Yep, and it's a long story, bro. Jimmy! Oh, shit! Kid, watch out for the boom! Fuck! Ah, Hold on! Dad! Help! 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 Come on! Get under him, man! Let him drop the hell! The fuck is wrong with you, kid? Dad! Don't dad me, you little shit! You better hope she's still seaworthy. Yay! Oh, man! Come on, come on, come on, come on! Come on, kid, come on, kid! Ah, oh, shit! Shit, shit, ah, shit! Ah, crap! Hey, get me off this damn thing! I ain't jumping for here, man! Get me off! All a fucking board? Let's stop this ship from sailing. How many guys are you going to kill for that boat? 
No, that doesn't sound good. Hey, that's the engine, man. We ain't chasing shit in this thing. Hold it together. Ah, my fucking boat. Hey, it's just a thing. At least you still got a son. Hey, it's a chop shop back there, dog. You drive us there, we can get the ride fit. My boat. It's just a thing. My boat. Please stop doing that. Listen, I fucked up, okay? I'm not going to lie. That was a really bad judgment call. But shit, Dad, I nearly died. And all you give a shit about is this fucking boat. No, it's not that. It's all we do is scream at each other. No wonder I can't get a job. It's all your fucking fault. Or it's not, but it's partly your fault. I, I mean, I just want to impress you. By selling my boat to some gangbangers? I know it sounds dumb when you put it like that, but all you do is daydream or get angry. Look, I love you, Jimmy, but you're an asshole. And right now, with my boat disappearing over the horizon, that's all I can see. Franklin, do you do me a favor and give this kid a ride home after they fix this thing? I want to headbutt the road in peace. Oh, great! Leave me with the home invader. I'll get it done, dog. No problem. Dad! Enough! All right? Enough! Franklin, do me a favor. Call me a taxi, will you? No problem. Hey, I need a cab as soon as you can send one. Los Santos Customs, by the airport. All right, thanks. Thank you. Hey, so you uh do much yachting? Not anymore. No, I don't. Before, I mean, man. No, no not really. This little shit stays in his room all day, and I don't have any other people to go with, you know? I like looking at it. Looking? Yeah. You know, I'd come down to the marina, sit on the dock, pour myself a drink, and look at it. Jacqueline. It'd clear my head, you know, let me dream. Jacqueline, huh? Well, maybe you need to do oh, some other man? stuff to fill your time. Dream other dreams, man. Yeah, sure. Whatever.
drink says a lot about the type of person you are. It's time to take hydration seriously. No, no. Your local water is terrible. It's time to make hydration real. That's why we filtered it, put it in a fancy bottle, and are marketing it using famous actors. It's time to make hydration real. Are you still drinking tap water? What's wrong? Hey, this the place up here. I know this dude, man. His name How. He gonna look after me. All right, take what's in my pocket. A couple thousand bucks. That'll cover it, right? Yeah, it should be cool. Good. So you sure you're good? Yeah, I got this. All right. Ooh, uh, I'm gonna come up front. Get out and walk around. It's okay, I can just climb over. Look, man, I'm gonna get the ride fixed, man, and drop it back off at your house along with this dude. It's all good, though, man. You go and get your head right, all right? All right, listen, thanks for today. I appreciate it. You stop back out to the house, we'll talk. Ugh, you see? Show, sure, man. Hey, sorry we didn't get your boat, man. Yeah. Come on, man. Let's trick this whip, homie. Still need to get you out for one of the races, Franklin. See if you drive as fast as you talk. Like Reconditioned. Sweet. Like I said, bro, trick it. Invader CEO Jay Norris. I'm gonna take you home now. It's Franklin, right? Yeah, Franklin. All the credit for our guy. The home invader. You know what? Call me what you like, man. Yeah, I, I, no, I, I mean, sure. Jimmy, ain't he? Or James? Jimmy. Or just like, Jizzle? <laughs> no, nah, man, I'll just stick with Jimmy, homie. So, uh, what's the deal, man? Huh? You and my old man? I see you at the dealership, and someone steals my whip, and Pop is all like, he's been down there to talk to you guys. Yo, Pops did more than talk. What'd he do? Look, man, if he ain't tell you, I ain't gonna tell you. But I lost my fucking job, and I thought maybe he could help me find a new one. Dude, my dad is retired, like, fully. Like, his only marketable skills are watching TV and daytime drinking. <sighs> man, look, I don't know, homie. He seems okay to me. Shit, he saved your ass. You saved my ass. Nah, nah, man. Well, well, maybe we good together, you know? Like, maybe we can get shit done we couldn't do separate. If it keeps him out of the house, that's cool by me. Yeah, well, we'll see. Look, I'm sorry my dad lost to your job. It's hard out there. Tough. I mean, I'm employmentally challenged at the moment. Oh, you got fired, dude. Damn, that's rough. Not fired as such. I didn't... Since we're both unemployed, like, we could run together, you know? Yeah, I think about it, homie. Or, or we could just, like, shop it, you know? Play darts or get our drink on? Strip clubs? Come on, dude, I get real crazy. Yeah, I got your number, shit, I need it, man, but, uh... Hey, hey you know what? Man, go easy on your pops, dog. all right? All right, church. <laughs> exactly, man. My brother from another mother. I mean, I, I hope so, because my mom was kind of a skank back in the day. See ya. Yeah, whatever, homie. Peace.
Hey, look, man. Look! You were like a son to me. Employee of the month. Does that mean nothing to you? Man, the dude had a gun in my head. No loyalty, no integrity. You should have taken the bullet. My business, my totally legitimate business. You are fucked, my boy. Fucked. Get off that no, thing! No, no. Ah! Screw this. Yeah.